Hi, I'm Oscar van Deventer and this is the Kaleido Penta. Kaleido Penta is a kinetic uh, sculpture uh, that is uh, based on the concept of the Kaleido cycle. However, where Kaleido cycle has uh, six parts that are moving, Kaleido Penta has only five parts. So here you can see how the parts move through each other. And it's, uh, you can also see it uh, sideways. It's a very pleasing uh, motion how you can see the five pieces turn through each other. So the way that uh, this prototype was made is I took a cylindrical rod that you see here and the second cylindrical rod and I turned the axis by 50 degrees. And then I uh, put them together and I used lock nuts and screws to put them together. And what makes Kaleido Penta interesting is that it's a, it's a sculpture that can exist in practice, because you see it here, but it cannot exist in theory, because when you try and uh, put this together, the pieces don't fit. This is exactly the reason why I used lock nuts, because the pieces are forced together, and they make uh, use of uh, flexibility to make uh, them actually uh, move. So it's uh, quite surprising that it uh, can work in practice but not in uh, theory. And this is uh, what the question of this uh, puzzle is about. Or this, uh, how can we make this thing work in practice? So it would be possible to do it in a trivial way. We can flatten it. So uh, by the way, here's uh, uh, a wooden uh, 3D printed wood version but you can see that if we would flatten it then all the axes of the puzzle or the object would be in the same direction but then we would have a trivial solution but also the parts would move through each other. So the question to you is can you find a non-trivial way for this uh, kinetic sculpture to work with five rigid parts and five axes? Thank you for watching.